Rantality. What's going on, my family? Your boy Demetrius is back, and here we are going to talk about Ubisoft and what the hell is going on at Ubisoft right now. Now, if y'all keeping track of Ubisoft or Ubisoft games or shit like that, it's been said that Ubisoft has canceled numerous games, including the new Ghost Recon game, a Splinter Cell VR game, and a couple of other games. I know a couple of other games they needed to cancel, like that fucking X Defiant bullshit. Yeah, I don't know if that, that was one of the games that was on the roster, but uh, they need to go ahead and cancel that game. So, man, we are just going to discuss some shit about what the fuck's going on at Ubisoft. Now, everybody knows I've been defending Ubisoft for the longest. I have been saying that Ubisoft is the best gaming company in the world. I still stand by that today because they really haven't done nothing wrong as far as releasing bullshit you know what i'm saying ubisoft hasn't released a game and it's been totally fucked up like the gta trilogy y'all feel what i'm saying or cyberpunk 2077 ubisoft has not done that and they really don't do that they had a couple of slip ups you know what i'm saying in the past but ubisoft is one of the most consistent out there i know a lot of people gonna disagree but guess what you can always disagree with what's real you feel what i'm saying we do that all the time but the real thing is Ubisoft is the best gaming company in the world and they have been for some time now but here man we're gonna have to dig down on what's really going on here and the first thing that I kind of notice is that it's been uh, reported that Ubisoft has canceled the Ghost Recon Battle Royale game now I know not too many people really care about Battle Royale like you know Battle Royale is kind of is what it is you know what I'm saying the whole PUBG thing and of course Fortnite and then, you know, games like Call of Duty tried to copy off of those two games and shit like that. So, you know, Battle Royale, it's 50-50. People like it. People hate it or whatever. I mean, to me, you know, I was always, I was a PUBG guy. I don't really fuck with Fortnite. I, I don't fuck with Fortnite at all. I'm going to be serious. But I was always that PUBG guy. And when I was playing PUBG, I always got it in my head like, hmm, what would a game like Ghost Recon or Rainbow Six, how would these games look in uh, Battle Royale? Now, Call of Duty clearly didn't work for Battle Royale because it's first person. I don't think you can have a first person Battle Royale game. I think that's just completely stupid. But Ghost Recon, third person game, Battle Royale, I was actually looking forward to that Ghost Recon Battle Royale game. But... Ubisoft decided to go ahead and cancel that project even though it was one of those you know I was looking forward to it because Ghost Recon is one of my favorite franchises as far as gaming is concerned so I kind of felt like you know it would have been interesting to see what they would have came up with as far as ideas and shit like that because a Ghost Recon and Battle Royale would have made a little bit of sense y'all feel what I'm saying but they decided to scratch that game I ain't mad at Ubisoft for doing that. At first, when this report came out, I was shitty. I was like, what is Ubisoft doing? But then, you know, after doing some studying, after doing some reading, I kind of understand what's going on. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, that Ghost Recon Battle Royale, they scratched that. I'm like, hey, it is what it is. Maybe they'll work on another Ghost Recon game. Kind of bring that feel back that they had with, you know, with Badlands and shit. You feel what I'm saying? You know, because that was a classic ass fucking game. You know what I'm saying? kind of bring that feel back and make a new project and then this whole splinter cell vr shit man i'm glad they canceled that shit too we don't need no stealth action vr game we just don't fucking need that and the best thing about it is they're still working on the splinter cell remake game so i am happy for that ubisoft has confirmed that the splinter cell remake is still in development so it's all good with the Splinter Cell. The Splinter Cell VR shit, yeah, go ahead and cancel that. Nobody don't give a fuck because we all waiting for that remake. And then like a couple of other games, they really didn't say which games were canceled, but I hope it's that stupid X Defiant game. You know what I'm saying? They need to go ahead and cancel that shit too. So like I said, I was shitty at first when I heard this because one of the main uh, games that I was thinking about when they said Ubisoft was canceling games was the Splinter Cell remake and I was like oh man come on Ubisoft don't do this shit don't do this shit but you know that game is still in development so uh 
you know, for those of y'all that are waiting for the new Splinter Cell game, it's still coming. It's still coming. Ubisoft has still got that in the works. But it's like I said, that Ghost Recon Battle Royale, that shit really did interest me. I was really looking forward to seeing what was going to happen with that. But they decided to scratch that game. But like I said before, I ain't mad at Ubisoft because it was one of those 50-50 things. You know what? If it would have came out, I would have checked it out or whatever. If not, if not. But like I said before, you know, you know, Ubisoft just being cautious right now just kind of look like it. What more can you ask for? You feel what I'm saying? If you don't have no trust and no belief in the project, go ahead and cancel it before anticipation starts to rise. Y'all feel what I'm saying? Don't be like bitch ass rock star games. Just put shit out there just because it's a title that everybody know. You feel what I'm saying? So kudos to Ubisoft for, you know, thinking things through and just basically saying, OK, you know what? This Ghost Recon Battle Royale shit just ain't for us. It ain't going to work. So they scratched it. Splinter Cell VR ain't for us, so they scratched it. Hopefully, X Defiant, they scratched that shit too. But like I said, man, um, I just wanted to come over here and just, you know, talk about the shit that's going on with Ubisoft because, you know, like I said, I'm a big Ubisoft supporter. I grew up with Ubisoft ever since, you know, early PC days, the first Xbox days. And I've said it before and I'll say it again. Ubisoft helped put the first Xbox on the map. You feel what I'm saying? It was Ubisoft that helped Xbox get out there. And, you know, I'm ever in debt for that of Ubisoft because if it wasn't for Ubisoft doing what they were doing, Xbox probably wouldn't be a thing right now. You know, a lot of people just really need to stop and think about that. You know, Ubisoft's contributions to the original Xbox, it made the Xbox. I'm just being that dead serious. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, they are the best gaming company in the world right now. And it is good to see that they are making cautious moves. And one of the things that I, I just hope they just, I don't know if there is a mention of a new Assassin's Creed game. I really don't know, but I hope it they don't go that route. They just put out another Assassin's Creed and then just, you know, have everything else on hold. I hope Ubisoft don't do that shit, you know, let Assassin's Creed rest, you know what I'm saying? And focus on the titles that got you there. You know, I'm, I'm just really tired of these companies following the rock star trend by just focusing on one title and that's it, man. That motherfuckers need to get off of that shit, you know. Start focusing on Rainbow. Start focusing on Splinter Cell like they've been doing, Ubisoft. That's what y'all need to do. Like I said, Ubisoft, I think they doing right by canceling what they canceled. And, you know, like I said, the Splinter Cell remake. Is still going on so I hopefully that splinter cell remake they putting that shit in the forefront and hopefully we hear something about that soon but uh let me know in the comment section what y'all think about Ubisoft's canceling and like I said I was pissed off at first but then you know I come to realize okay I understand what Ubisoft is doing they just not trying to put bullshit out here y'all feel what I'm saying so let me know what y'all think about this whole thing put it in the comment section below we can get this conversation started Make sure y'all comments are respectful. My name is Demetrius. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe for more of this gaming real talk. I will get back at you in the next video. I am out. God bless. Stay safe. Peace.